Pride. Come on. Let's go. Joy. Oh! I got it. Hopefulness. Just like that, the Skylanders Swap Force Nuzlocke is officially over. <laughs> Agony. Yeah, I got stuck. I got stuck. But does that mean our lives are meaningless? Does that mean that there was no point in our being born? Would you say that of our slain comrades? What about their lives? Were they meaningless? They were not! Their memory serves as an example to us all! The courageous fallen! The anguished fallen! Their lives have meaning because we, the living, refuse to forget them! And as we ride to certain death, we trust our successors to do the same for us! Because my soldiers do not buckle or yield when faced with the cruelty of this world! My soldiers push forward! My soldiers scream out! My soldiers run! As much as I hate to do it, we do have to restart. So here we are. Sparrow's Adventure once again. All of my Skylanders were hand chosen by my chat. So, um, this roster is your fault. I will be surprised if we don't have at least like five surviving members. Like, there's no shot that like we lose over half our team. This is pretty much just preparation for Giants. So, I should probably explain something that I have planned. So whenever a Skylander dies, in the next game, their element gets replaced by a brand new Skylander that was released in that game of their element. We're still going to do that, but instead of me picking it, chat is going to pick it. Well, not chat, because I'm not streaming, but you know, the viewers, you, you, right now, you watching, you are going to be able to get the pick who I use next. But instead of playing on hard mode, we're going to play on Nightmare Mode. Except for, you know, Sparrow's Adventure, because there is no difficulties in this game. But when we get the Giants, Giants and beyond, we are going to be playing on Nightmare. And to make things a little bit more fair for me, the level and the upgrades of my Skylanders don't get reset. Because whenever we start a new game, even if there are survivors, I normally reset the Skylander. But now that we're going to be playing on Nightmare, the Skylander will not be reset in between games. That is the brand new rule set I'm going to do for this Nuzlocke. And hopefully I don't fail again. So pretty much for right now, well, the Sparrow's Adventure run is just going to be a setup for the Nightmare Giants run. But that doesn't mean you should stop watching. Please keep watching. And also like and subscribe while you're at it bro that honestly kind of jump scared me just like low key <laughs> that menu kind of jump scared me also i've never used voodoo before in my entire life so this is completely new to me the th like my least favorite part about skylanders is always like the bullet sections and it's so fun how in chapter three of the first game is like <laughs> has like my least favorite part it's just crazy to think about really wait i wonder something can i just like teleport over there Okay, but imagine them. There's a lot going on. Oh, I'm hitting the wrong- I'm so used to not- <sighs> Okay, I'm not used to not being able to jump. That's why. If I die, that's the reason. So I'm so used to, to jumping around. I I'm so used to body hopping like a little loser. That's what I'm used to. I'm, <laughs> I'm used to jumping around and avoiding tags like a little loser. And I can't do that anymore, so I might die because of it. Gee, it might not be the brightest idea to <laughs> drag myself over the Brock. Or maybe it is. Who knows? No, it was. Gee, I can see this move actually helping me get out of, like, sticky situations. If there's, like, multiple enemies around, I can just, like, use this to pretty much grapple onto, like, the first one away. This would be useful. Also, I should probably... Actually, no. I was gonna say, I should probably switch so I don't, you know, waste any XP. But the end of the level is literally right there. Oh. Uh, <laughs> I'm now seeing something that i didn't think about before i can't read this but you know what it doesn't matter i can't upgrade anyway i don't know if i have my facts right but just seeing how this guy is like attacking and moving around i don't think warnado's that good and he's fast but like not strong dude warnado is not it why did you guys vote for him he's so bad can i like knock these guys off the edge that'd be awesome you flap oh oh i guess it kind of worked 
felt through to four, but you know. Okay, we're doing good. Uh, Ghost Roaster is also one of those scoundrels that I've never used before. So, we'll see what happens. But we have crazy mobility. I feel like Ghost Roaster's kind of just way too strong, you know? <laughs> I guess we'll see what happens. Maybe he'll die later. No, 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 no. Not again, not again. We're not doing that again. Skits, give me away from that fire gate. I'm not going anywhere near it. You will not catch me anywhere near this fire gate ever again. Okay, I'm going to assume that this is a damage upgrade. I think I was right. If I remember correctly, um, Drill Sergeant wasn't that good in our first run, so, you know, <laughs> well, I, I guess we'll see what happens. Bro, get, get, get out of my way! <laughs> no, I'm actually stuck. I'm actually stuck. Please die. Brother, brother, <laughs> I got stuck. Holy between the freaking Gilgrunt wannabe and that enemy, they tag teamed me. That's crazy. Hey, look, there's Ignitor Sword Gem. There's Ignitor's Sword Gem. <laughs> okay, that one, <laughs> that, one was on, that one was my fault. But was that one? <laughs> I mean, I told you. <laughs> If anything, it's good to get him out of the way because he's going to be useless. He is. He's only useful for one chapter, but like in that chapter, I can just use Dino Ring instead. Okay, now we're finally out of this chapter. Don't shoot me. Oh, you are so lame for that. Okay, do I want to be smart about this boss fight or do I want to be fun about it? Because <laughs> yeah, we do have the water element fight. I think having as much survivors for Nightmare Giants will just be the best idea. So tactically speaking, we don't want to throw. Yeah, I think I shouldn't throw for content and actually pick someone good. I think this is the best pick. Never mind, it's the worst pick. And I think Dino Ring was the right choice. I'm pretty sure Gilbert does three shots, then he shoots his little, uh, yeah, then he, he, okay. I know your pattern now. You can't beat me. Ow, he hit me. Okay, if I keep a good distance, slam bam should be easy. Unless I get throws him. I'm pretty sure he does like 40 damage a hit, which is kind of crazy. I wish my slam bam did that. No, he does 70 a hit. Okay, even better. Oh no! Oh no! I did not think they're gonna combo me that hard. Wow, wee. Okay. I was not expecting to get absolutely comboed like that. I think we're doing worse than our first run, which is kind of crazy. We do have like uh, worse scoundrels though, so. Also, I think going <laughs> Warnado here was a terrible idea. <laughs> but really, Dino Ring died like that? Getting absolutely comboed by Gilgrunt, the Sharks, and Slam Bam? What the heck? Yeah, I'm pretty sure, like, at this point in the first Nuzlocke, I've only lost Chop Chop, which makes sense because Chop Chop sucks. But, you know, we lost two this time. But even though I'm less familiar with this roster, I think it is overall better than the one I had last time. Like, I'm pretty, like, the only person I really used in this roster was, like, Kind of Dino Ring. Because <laughs> I had the Eons Elite, so I had some practice with him. But besides that, I have like, not used any of these guys, except for Slam Bam, of course. Okay, I'm guessing... Damage upgrade? <laughs> Maybe? Who knows? I don't have enough! Bro, three coins. I just need three. Come on. Okay. Beautiful damage upgrade. Actually, I do really think ghost roaster is gonna be a like a major like a major ally for the for these runs and we'll turn away free oh my goodness level four wowie zowie oh yeah since dino ring is gone who should be my uh, my boss killer i mean it could be it could be ghost roaster since he did kill the that earth golem wait i can wait i can, I can freeze them that's so that's actually hilarious oh okay 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 boss fight time who is going to do it? Ghost Roaster, right? I think this is the best 
choice I can make. Oh yeah, oh yeah, this is the right decision. This was the right decision. Actually, this one might be tough. Actually, never mind. <laughs> never mind. <laughs> Wait, is he not gonna do a melee attack? Wait, this thumb smash? Oh crap, does he not do melee attacks? I mean, that, that makes the triple fight more annoying, but like... <laughs> what? He's kind of throwing. Okay. Oh, who did I kill? Stealth Elf? <laughs> okay. I was trying to get a uh, stump smash, but I guess she just teleported behind him. Yeah, but actually just free. Actually free. Ghost Roaster, I did not know he was this crazy. Really is the boss slayer. Ow, bro. I love how you can hit me mid, mid animation where I can't move. That's so funny. And I'm not oh, crap. Actually, I think I can get a lot of upgrades, and I always forget to talk to Persephone. Because it always just, like, immediately puts me into the next chapter, so I just forget that I can upgrade. Oh, dude, Stump Smash is getting a crazy upgrade after this chapter. Wowie zowie. All right. I didn't grab a Soul Gem, and I do not know where it is. But can I get this last upgrade? Bro. And now we got a good upgrade. Can I not use this other move? Oh, wait, it's... We can also upgrade Warnado. What? Yeah, we are sitting super comfortable. Like, nothing else is gonna go wrong, right? Ow! Holy crap! Oh! Not like this! Not like this! Ow! Oh my! That is so crazy! That is actually crazy, what? I, I can't believe ignite or die like that. That was actually just so embarrassing. <laughs> okay, it's kind of funny how whenever you kill a tank, like inside the tank it has a green troll, but when you actually kill it, out comes an orange troll. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh, not again, we're not doing this again. Ow, I'm trying to fight this mini boss, bro. Can you not shoot at me with your guns? Oh, the combo to finish things off? Kinda nasty. Okay, let's get more upgrades. I do want the ice skating one, but I probably don't have enough for it. Uh, yeah. Oh, are we doing the undead levels already? Bro, are you really gonna be like this? <laughs> what are we? Get, get, weave, weave. Oh, if I just give me a bomb for this, like, little, like, arena battle, to just pretty much just automatically win. <laughs> it's so kind of them. Okay, it's just <laughs> having to walk all the way up to persephone every single time on an upgrade is just wild Ooh, right this this might be where warnado gets into a bit of trouble <laughs> well not this specific fight but you know just that gimmick in general what this guy's mounted up on his teammate this is great what oh this is kind of bad oh, never mind i can just use a cannon to kill them <laughs> no Oh my dude. Warnado, your garbage is showing. Okay, we're good. <laughs> we're good. No, why'd I go here with. Oh no. Mistakes have been made. I went into this fight with Warnado. <laughs> but technically, I could switch now. Because they're not in a fight. I have convinced myself to switch. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> ah! Oh, bro, this little guy. He won't die! He won't die! He won't die! This little guy's invincible! Holy! He wouldn't die! He wouldn't die! Okay, yeah, Stump Smash has gotten real strong. Or not! Maybe he sucks, actually! Maybe he sucks! <laughs> Maybe he sucks! That was the stupidest thing I've ever seen! Okay, I think it's the boss fight. Yeah, it is. Okay. And Ghost Roaster is our boss killer, so... Bro, all this laughing. Dude, I have to play this so carefully. This sucks. Yep, got him. Okay, chop chop dead. Got him, got him, got him, got him. Okay, speedrun. Yep, okay. <laughs> this freaking bum rush, dude. Come on, yes! Let's go, Ghost Roaster. Okay, things got really close, but we got him. Let's go! Huge, dude, huge. It's also still crazy that Stump Smash died. Okay, we got some upgrades here. I do want a third move. It sucks not having anybody to just easily destroy these rocks. 
I have, to, I have to use the hammer? Ew! Oh, oh yeah, there is the boss fight here. Um, Ghost Roaster. <laughs> Wait, I can do this? Wait, that's actually amazing. I'm so much better than you. <laughs> okay, Ghost Roaster. All right, Ghost Roaster. You are the boss slayer. So don't disappoint. <laughs> okay, what's the plan here? I don't actually know. Kill you. Don't get killed by the freaking cutscene. Okay. Got him. Let's go, Ghost Roaster. Bro stays the boss killer. He's level 9. Oh my goodness. Gonna get him maxed out soon. Hey, not having anyone with like actual range kind of sucks. But we do get ice skating, so let's go. Okay, actually, Warnado does kind of have range. Not good range, but still range. Bro, why is there more every single time? Why is it? <gasps> why is them being stuck kind of screw me over? Dude, like, actually, them getting stuck on the gate was just so bad for me. Wow, we. <laughs> uh oh, oh, uh, wait. Oh, wait, no, no, no. I actually need to beat these guys. I actually need to. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I was like, maybe I could just like, go past and just use the key. But no, I'm gonna die. Yeah, no, we're cooked. Yeah. No, literally, there's nothing I could do. Well, we are automatically doing way worse than we did our original run. Which is crazy. <laughs> so... We're cooked. <laughs> okay, something that does suck a lot is that, like, I don't think my team is strong. Hear me out, right? Like, if you look at every character I've had... Like, none of them are ranged characters, except for, like, Drill Sergeant. And Drill Sergeant... Well, he's Drill Sergeant. Yes, yeah, so, like, honestly, except for Ghost Roaster, Slam Bam and Voodoo are not gonna be useful for, like, the, the, like, the last couple chapters. Like, I really don't think, like... Like, these melee guys are strong, but, like, compared to ranged calendars, they're just really not that good. Like, they can be like, physically stronger, of course, but, like... Honestly, if you don't have ranged, you're kind of just asking to die. But, you know, we'll see what happens. We have Ghost Roaster, and he kind of just always wins. Like, of course, I'm not saying, like, I'm going to lose because I have no ranged characters. I'm the greatest Gauntlet player of all time, after all. I'm just saying. It'd be a lot easier if I did. Oh, we are going to Chaos. Okay. Chaos is Fortress. Let's do it. We have three landers left, and I think we lose zero. Here we go. Chaos boss fight. Let's run it. Stealth elf? Okay, well, immediately dies. <laughs> kind of. Okay, as long as we just don't get the undead dragon, we're sitting very well. Just only water. Water and grass. Or no, <laughs> life. Ooh, slam bam is rough. Getting the slam bam shadow lander is so. Uh, they really gave me two shadow landers. I pretty much do the exact same thing. And they did undead. That's awesome. <gasps> Oh my goodness. All right, final phase. <laughs> Ow, I can't even got hit by that. What? Get hit by every shoot. Yeah, let's get hit by everything, won't you? Ow. This might be it, this might be it. One more, one more, one more, one more, one more phase. One more cycle, I mean. Got him. Ghost Roaster, the Boss Slayer. The Boss Slayer, Ghost Roaster. Unbelievable. What a performance. What a performance. So there you have it. Round two of Nuzlocke, or season two as you could say, has gone off with a great start. And over the next couple of days, you will be seeing community posts of you pretty much being able to vote who I use next in Giants. Because we are going to nightmare mode, please pick some good ones. Anyway, that's about it. It's done, you know.